All right, we're back. Uh, I'm trying to decide whether or not I want to go grind out some armor or uh, try and get more S drops from the chests. Actually, we have decent enough armor as is, and with Jiro, um, Jiro having the poker now. Oh shit, that reminds me, I forgot to, um, look up what all the weapons do passively. I think I'm going to, uh, head into that level 95 and try and get a really high level, uh, well, not necessarily high level, but just try and get a, uh, wait, no, didn't I want, no, I remember now. I wanted to get the platinum... King Jewels or whatever. Oh, but that's right. First I wanted to... Revocate myself one more time. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna do that. I should have enough... Uh, nope. Wrong person. I should have enough HP and with the medallion enough MP to be able to go straight to, um... Uh, straight to, uh, King Slimes. God damn it. Why do I suck with menus so bad? Yeah, cause... If I revocate to, uh, um, four, then, uh, in total... I have, like, an 81% chance to get an A or S rank Grotto. And considering they're the ones that uh, have the Platinum King Jewels, they're the ones you want. Hopefully I get another super, super low quality one, so that way I might finally be able to get Nemen or Nemean. Also, since I'm by myself, like I'm not having any backup for hunting these slimes. Ooh, that's actually not a lot of HP. Um. Oh no, did I? Okay, no, I got it. I'll do one round of um, liquid metal. Should turn the code on. Just get myself back to level 99. Then I'm gonna start grinding up Grottos from that level 95 one. I don't think I'm gonna get better than a 95 one. And if I do, it's probably just gonna be like 90, like 96, 97, like where it's not that big of a difference. Cause um. Getting in the level 99 one is pretty hard. By pretty hard, I mean I am one unlucky bastard. Plus, it wouldn't even make that much of a difference. It would just be the highest chance of getting an A or S rank from farming it. Now, can I do this without turning the code on? I mean, obviously not for the King Metals, so I gotta turn it on anyway. Alright, guess not. Mode, here we come. Can't wait to uh, save and restart. So I don't crash the game by running through that little 95 grotto that's definitely not going to take six hours just to get to the bottom of it. Oh, no, 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 no. Not him. Not him either. Yeah. Watch now, there's going to be just one chill in there. No? Alright. My, uh, okay, yeah. I, w I was worried that my audio wasn't, uh, capturing properly. Dickhead. I mean, with how far this pushes me level-wise, I'll probably have around, like, 
Maybe 250, 300 HP just from one of these fucks? I mean, I'll have to heal, but whatever. Yeah, look at that. 160,000. Yeah, I went to 313 HP. I'm fine to fight the Metal Slimes in it. Or the King Metals, once I heal. Uh, that's just using some items. Right. Also, I've never tested to see if that code lets you fight bosses outside of the arenas. I'm assuming no, since it crashes the game when you try and fight a boss. So I'm assuming like it doesn't let you spawn a boss either. But you never know. I mean, based on the rules, you're not allowed to, but just when you're playing uh, casually, it might be something neat. Just to not have to run through a seven hour long grotto, just fight one guy. Yeah, I was gonna say, I'm pretty sure I have a perfect fantasy there. Look at regular. Oh, they both feel 90. I just wasted the perfect one. Oh well. Ooh, convenient. It's gonna be the first one where I might get to level 99 in one episode. Why did I say that out loud? It's like the number one rule of fucking everything. I thought I'd be going up faster. Okay. I'll take it. <laughs> oh no. Yeah, I realized uh, I'm not going to be able to flee from these guys, so if I get in a situation where I run out of... I didn't want to do that. I did not want to do that. say uh if i get into a situation where i run out of mp i either have to uh hope it runs away or hope i get one of those random crits because um they have enough damage to eventually kill me and if they kill me while i'm by myself i have to sacrifice uh, was it was it just the items one party member has or was it all the items i have and that party member has Look at the rules.
Okay. It was just all the items on that party member. So I'd have to sacrifice a person and all the items they have. And quite frankly, that would be a major loss because that means I would not be able to get the, um... I wouldn't be able to get their, um, like, scrolls and medallions back and shit like that. Like, once those are gone, those are gone for good. That would have been cool if it hit. That one just really, really did not want to fucking die. Should still have like a shit ton of magic waters, right? Yeah. Ooh, not as many as I thought. Uh, how much HP? That's funny.
I really hope the game doesn't like perma crash or something if I go above 999 skill points. Cause I mean, in reality, what kind of motherfucker would have that many skill points unused? I also may change the rules about how skill points work to uh, four categories that you have to put 100 points into. So you have a pool of 400 points and you can put them wherever the fuck you want. I mean, I'm still gonna do four different categories, 100 points each, every single time I do this because that's just how I play the game. But I can definitely see, like, um, I can definitely see the potential to make a bunch of weird ass characters. Gotta stop back and heal up. Probably the fastest metal slime farm ever. I'm thinking one more should do it. And when I say one more, I mean two because it's gonna drop me off at 98. Because this game hates me. No, I just wanna say one thing. If Dragon Quest 12 is like Dragon Quest 9, where it's a full team of custom characters. Uh, I will buy the shit out of that game. I'll, I'll probably put as many hours in that game as I have this one. Alright, uh, we're done, and there's still 10 minutes. Wow, that only took technically more like 15 minutes, because the first 5 minutes I was sticking around. Uh, so I guess I'll grab my party back, save, reset, and uh, we'll turn the code off, save, reset. And then, uh, we'll go into that level 95 dungeon, and I'll end it, like, halfway through it. Still can't believe I got poker. Like, that was probably, out of all of the 1% drops I could have ever just randomly gotten, 
Jiro is probably the best one. Since Jiro's damage output is higher than Bakugo's because she hits four times. Like against single bosses. Against Mortimer, that's not gonna work. At least I think it's Mortimer that I'm thinking about. One of the um one of the legacy bosses has three different bodies that you need to attack. So multi stab doesn't really work too well on that guy. That's why Uber Falcon Blade is still just su vastly superior choice. Because um It's uh it hits four times, but it's single target. Instead of random target. Plus it's guaranteed four times, not that crap where sometimes it only hits three times. Why did I fucking maximize the menu? I need to reset. Hopefully the remaining, I guess like, 8 minutes now, isn't just spent trying to find the fucking dungeon. That would be, um, not fun. Everyone's so filled- well, except for Bakuno, but oh, I need to uh, give him back the critical thing. Fortress, and we will head off to uh, level 95. <laughs> No fucking way. There's no way, that's just another one by Stornway. Well, I got a 33% chance to get a uh, S rank. 47% chance to get an A rank. Cannot wait to... Uh, where is it? Is this, is this not the right place? Oh, why not at the right place? I'm not at the right place. Okay, that makes more sense. Can't wait for it to uh, be a B rank. I mean, I'm still gonna pick shit up from this grotto. Like, chests and shit, obviously. What am I doing? What am I doing? I don't think it's going to be down here. Hmm. Those guys showing up on floor one is kind of scary. Oh, it's all the way over there. Those guys showing up on floor one is just annoying. And say I can't believe I got away, but then this fuck just sits on the exit. There's no way. Okay, yeah, I was gonna say. No fucking way. This is just a straight line to the thing. It's gotta have some kind of complication to piss me off. Okay. So, uh, that wasn't a dead- oh, that was chess. Gotta go back for that shit. Oh boy, I went down that hallway for no reason whatsoever.
Come on. Probably don't need to use such a um expensive spell. Huh. Exits in the uh, top few floors are really close. Which means there probably isn't any chest that I'm gonna find. You know, besides that one. Yep. The whale doesn't follow you, right? Alright, good. Oh, he does perfectly block the fucking hallway, though. Are you kidding me? Get your whale ass out of here. Oh! This game, man. It really knows exactly how to piss me off. Talk him up. Okay, look at that. Muscle bill. I don't think that's bad. I'm pretty sure that's a gladiator only one, but I don't think it's better than uh, Gigant Armor. Yeah, no. Oh, it's for everyone, but only dudes. I think that might be a 1% drop. the chest. No. Oh, good. oh, come on. Fucking whale, man. Did I hit the whale or the camera? Shit, I hit the whale. How much HP does this thing have? Oh my god. Trident. Well, that would be nice if I, um, you know, didn't have poker. You don't see me. You do not see me. Shit. Oh, it's just one. I don't care.
I care a little. Shogun variant. I think it's above me. Really? Straight line? No tiny ass hallway I need to run through? Okay. Oh shit, I need any episode. 